ど<笑>おおスタンドアップ Did you just hear that? Yeah, it feels good That was my shoulder <sighs> Yeah, it like fucking that, stretches Stretches on Now let's do the bare-legged chicken squawk Yeah, jump up, grab both feet back behind and then let go and slam What? Okay, show <laughs> No, you have to show Dude, what did you I just say? You I want to make sure that this is an angle at least. Okay, look. Dude, you saw you just did that <laughs> one at a time. You do both and then land. And land? So I have to grab both of them? Yeah. Oh my god. If I do it successfully, you have to do it. Okay? You're going to have to jump high at that. Okay. Hit your head on that. <laughs> just fucking. <laughs> okay, yeah. Hold on, I got to be back far enough. Okay. <laughs> I did it though. I totally did it. <laughs> you gotta be fucking. <laughs> That's Grab called the bare legged squat. chicken squat. That's called the herniated knee herder. <laughs> knee herder. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Young money. Hey, yo, fur. Yeah. Young money. Young money. Hey, yo, fur. Yeah. talk about something I'm just gonna tell you real fast a conversation I had with somebody I, it wasn't recent it was just something that I was thinking about that I I kind of want to tell you so I'm in my house and this girl is there and she's like <sighs> and then I'm then I say you know okay you know what's wrong what's are you okay what was that for? <sighs> Nothing. That did not. Uh, should I be concerned? <sighs> just uh, no. Okay, now you have to say. It. Say no. You have to say it now. Say just say. It. What what's what's wrong? Just this. My ex boyfriend smells like that. I should have said that, but I just got like a whiff. It's gone now, but. 
got a whiff of something. Can you imagine if I was just like, oh, my ex-girlfriend smelled like that. No. She wouldn't fly, Jose. Oh, I'm back, I guess. And today, I kind of wanted to jump into one of those motivational segments, I want to say, because I, the reason I haven't done one in so long is because I need to get on to myself here for this. This is like, I need to start taking responsibility for this, this stupid shit. I understand I've been fucking slacking on YouTube and it's not because I've lost passion. It's because I've gotten way, way too comfortable. I've gotten too comfortable with where I'm at. I'm like, yeah, I got good. I got a good amount of subs. I, 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 I can do what I want. I travel a lot. I got a lot of friends. I'm getting too fucking comfortable. I'm, I need to stop. I have stopped like in my head. I'm like, no, I cut that shit. No, none of that done that's a promise i make to you as my family i even went and got another fucking tattoo that's when i started this youtube channel that's how much it fucking means to me it's 2017 it's my favorite number it's a year i realized what i want to do and that i want to dedicate this shit and i i owe you guys an apology because you guys aren't going to wait up for me you guys aren't going to wait up for anybody and i don't want you to uh that's just human nature another thing it is is 2020 and I'm too, too fucking excited for this year to happen. I'm too, I'm too excited to do the things that I'm going to do. I have a bunch of New Year's resolutions. And I'm not going to share all of them right away. You will know all of these, but I'm going to kind of pan them out. And my first one is to triple down on YouTube. And I'm more than excited. Got a new camera, as you guys know, and I'm just more than thrilled to be using this thing. I have used it. I love it. It's my dream. You know, this is just the shit to me. But something else I wanted to even further step on was I have a clear tunnel vision for what I'm wanting to do this year. I already have, and I'm I'm doing it right now as we speak by making this video and I'm about to go edit it directly after. I'm about to go eat what I'm supposed to eat in order to gain this um, weight back. And uh, another huge comment that I've gotten lately is, Derek, you get sick all the time. I had the stomach bug recently and that wasn't because of uh, some, just because I get sick all the time. So many people are getting it. All, all, pretty much like I would say over half of my gym buddies are getting it. We get it. I got it at the gym like they did. And, and literally the same gym. And uh, my, you know, Austin, who's in today's video, he works, uh, he's a prison guard. And he said 22 people on his floor alone in the last three days or four days, something like that, got it. And it's violent. You just shit and puke and it empties you out completely for like a day and then it's over. And those of you out there who have gotten it, I have tons of family friends, tons of people reaching out saying, fuck, dude, I had that too. Austin got it like a month ago. So it's just retarded. Um, and I get strep every fucking year, like at least two or three times. This year I think I've gotten it three times, maybe four. And that's just because I have big ass tonsils. They're like strawberries. I need to get them removed. I'm stupid. Like I just get sick from strep super easy and I'm really prone to allergies and tons of people are telling me, Derek, get your fucking tonsils out because I used to get sick all the time and got them out and haven't been sick in years. So I probably should do that this year actually, but that kind of scares me. But fuck it. On this channel, we're all about facing our fears, right? I think I should, I think I should just go face that one. God. I am not excited about doing that, but you know, and you go understand that that's just sacrifice, no sacrifice, no victory, you know? So I'm going to do that. And then I got E. coli for that span of three months. You guys remember where I pretty much didn't upload any YouTube videos and was dead. That that's where a lot of stupid bad habits that I have currently broken about half of, and I'm breaking more of them. The last one I just have to break is like quit drinking so much. I'm around my friends and shit a lot. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, I didn't fucking stop drinking so much. Uh, that's another New Year's thing. But other than that, I'm I'm really good. I'm getting back on my YouTube grind, at least two videos a week. I just uploaded one yesterday at recording this. You guys might get two in a row. Maybe even three. Who knows? And, um, yeah, it's just fucking ridiculous because 
So that explains why I got sick a lot. I couldn't help E. coli because I fucking ate a stupid ass hamburger that I wish I could take back. All that would take is just not eating that one burger and then I would have been fine. And yeah, so that's why I get sick all the time. I had a bunch of tests done, making sure that like everything else is normal. I had two blood tests that tested everything. Clean sweep, different hospitals, different practices completely all the tests came back completely normal i have slightly slightly high blood pressure that's it and it said my test was i think at like a seven seven sixty out of a thousand it can be it says you can in normal range is anywhere from 500 to a thousand and i'm right at like 760 so it's just an active young teen person i was kind of pissed i want to be a little bit higher than that but don't take my word for it. Those of you who think I'm, think I'm juicing and shit, fuck you. <laughs> and, uh, guys, if I ever do start doing steroids, you, you will be the first to know. I'm not going to be, I'm not going to claim that I'm natural. I'm going to come straight on this channel, and I'm going to tell you guys that I, I'm doing steroids. Or if I plan to start, I'm going to be like, okay, guys, this is what I'm going to take. This is blah, 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 blah. And then maybe you guys could honestly go with me if I make that decision. I haven't made a decision yet, I'm not saying that. But I'm saying if I ever start do, doing steroids and start juicing and getting on gear, you guys are gonna know. But I won't be able to say, hey guys, this is Derek Martin, the All Natural Bodybuilder anymore. I'll say, hey Derek, this is, or hey guys, this is Derek, the Enhanced Athlete. That's what I would change it to. I've already thought about all this in my fucking head. <laughs> but a lot of you guys are probably gonna be like, no, don't fucking do it. You work so hard. Yeah. I know, I know, I know. I haven't done anything yet. I mean, but my whole thing is just honest with you guys. And I, honestly, I'm just on here fucking word vomiting to you guys because I just miss talking to you and I miss this. And I, I know that this part of the video is not the majority of the people's favorite, but those ones that really care and the ones that really want to know me and want and know a lot of shit that's going on in my life and they're just like looking at me. You guys are the ones I'm talking to. The ones that understand my personality and things and like this. And this is a slower paced video. I get it. That's why I try to make the beginning of it more exciting and shit. So that you guys can hop off after that. And be like, okay, that was cool. Bye-bye. Whatever. But this is for the ones that want to stay and catch up with me and see what's going on. And um, honestly, things are great. My OnlyFans is awesome. Uh, that's another New Year's resolution is to fucking post like every day on that or more at least. And I... I, I Damn, you guys just blow me away completely. Uh, I get overwhelming amounts of support. My Instagram family is good. My YouTube family is good. My Twitter family has even grown. I barely post on there. So it's kind of crazy. And I, my Snapchat, like, a lot of really good reinforcement on there. It's just, you guys know that I've never been, like, seeking followers, 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 followers. You know, I don't beg for that shit. I don't ask for shout outs. I don't, I don't do shout out for shout out. I don't do none of that shit. I do this because I like doing it. And it surprises me how many people have jumped on board because of it. And I can't thank you enough. Person watching. Not, oh guys. Oh, I'm not talking plural. I'm talking singular to you watching. Whether it's somebody I know in real life because I don't know who's watching this right now. If you, if I know you in real life, thanks for the support. If I don't know you in real life, I'd love to meet you someday. And this year, I, I would love to do some meet and greets. If we, if we can organize that, and you guys want that, I've a lot of people have told me, Derek, you got to do meet and greet. Want to meet you? Want to shake your hand? Want to ask you questions? You want to do all that? And I would love to meet you guys. Uh, I got people from all over the world too. If you're someone in a different country. What's up? <laughs> I can't believe that my video made it all the way to people like in Brazil and in China. And I think there's a few people in Germany watching. And there's like, I have a, I have a lot of people. It's, it's kind of, kind of cool. I'm not a celebrity. I'm not even popular. I don't even want to say I'm popular yet. But I really do appreciate you guys. And just being back and talking to you guys right now, it's, it feels like home. It feels good. I love being back on this damn channel. I love being back on this camera. It's feels like I'm where I'm feels like where I'm supposed to be. And I know this wasn't really a motivational thing. This was clearly just fucking like I said, word vomit update. I'm trying to put a lot into words about how I'm currently feeling about YouTube. Never burnt out. I 
you know, you hear a lot about YouTuber burnout and people are just like, okay, you make fucking videos. Shut up. You don't shut up. No burnout. But you have to really love what you do if you're going to do it for a long time. And I do love this. I, I do. I really do. And I always have passion for it. Just sometimes the execution of it shine, shows and shines through brighter than other times, if you know what I mean. Just like anything. Just like parenting. Just like going to the gym itself. You know, you have good days and bad days. I, fortunately, lately, have had a lot of good days. Uh, it's just like family. Sometimes you fight, sometimes you don't. And it's just like a relationship. Sometimes you fight, sometimes you don't. And it's just like so many things. It's just like traffic. Sometimes, sometimes you hit every green light. And sometimes you hit every fucking red light and there's an accident. And the fucking road, and you gotta wait on that too. Good days and bad days. You gotta take your lumps, as my mama used to say. <laughs> take your lumps and move on. Some days are smooth sailing, and some days are fucking high tides. And you have to accept that. Once you accept that, that you can fucking crash through some of this shit and be like, okay, this is this is not smooth sailing. This sucks. This fucking actually hurts. And um, you yeah. know. So there it is. That's how I'm that's how I'm feeling. I'm going to cut myself off here because I think that the majority of you guys probably signed off, but <laughs> those of you who are still here, thank you. Again, once again, I'm Derek Martin, the all natural bodybuilder right now. <laughs> and I will hopefully see you in the next video. Can't say how much I appreciate you enough. Peace.